little bit about the green room already. You know about the kitchen. You know about the green room. You know about Jess's office. You know to do your dishes. Do your dishes. So again, we've got our call boards here. Remember those. These are your dressing rooms. This is where you get to from the green from the green room. That's how you get to your dressing rooms, right? But we're not going to the dressing rooms. We're going to the lobby. Just up these stairs. This door is the audience entrance into the theater. Uh, spectator seating even. The numbering on the seats is even and odd. It may or may not come up in the future, but right now it's just the general seating. But if we ever had to do a sign seating, people could enter from this side with their tickets that said, I'm sitting in A22, because this is the even side of the theater, and the odd side of the theater is on the other side. There is another that says spectator sitting seating odd on the other side. While we're here, I'm just gonna point out this light. Sometimes, quite frequently actually, um, you have instances where an actor needs to enter from the audience. And of course it's sound, it's more or less sound, if it's not soundproof, it's sound muffled out here, and there's no program sound out here, so you can't hear what's happening. So how are you gonna know when to enter? This is a cue light. Um, we have these lights set up over here and on the other side. Uh, and if you're waiting here, you'll be waiting for that light to light up. Uh, and when that light lights up, that means it's time for you to open the door and make your entrance. Uh, but if you have to use it, we'll go over the protocol for it. Just to let you know, there's one over here, there's one over there. And that's where they are, and that's what they're for. Let's go to the lobby. So this is our lobby. This is the lobby of Dawson's Theater. Uh, it's very clean and white and has lots of windows. Uh, if you are working a front of house shift, this is where a lot of your calls are going to be, um, particularly during the show. Um, ushers, boss office staff, ticket takers, you all work out of here. Uh, as I was saying in the booth, there's a monitor here that shows you program video. If I were to turn it on right now, you would see that it shows nothing. No, it shows a picture of the stage. There's something going on on stage right now, but that's what it shows. It's a static shot of the stage and what's happening on there. So that people who are coming in can see what's happening, can catch up with things, and so that you in the, in the, uh, in the box office can know when to admit they come. This is our box office over here. This is where we sell tickets from. Just turn off the light. So, if you're doing an FOH shift and you're working in box office, this is where this is. Um, we sell tickets from here. We receive reservations from here. Um, the audience, th that's the audience entrance over there, those big glass doors. When the audience comes into the theater, they come in through there, they buy the tickets here. And we have a computer in here that has access to our reservations list. Uh, we have a fridge here because sometimes we sell refreshments at intermission. Um, the other thing I want to point out in this room, you can't, I'll try and keep my distance here. There's a sink in the corner. That's our mop sink. And this is when you are an assistant stage manager. And I do say when. Um, this is where you're going to come to fill your mop so you can mop the floor. Uh, I think we've all learned a lot about cleanliness in the last couple of months, and it has not stopped being important. It has always been important in the theater, it is especially important now. So, sweeping them up in the stage is going to be something that an assistant stage manager does before every show in that theater, and when you come to mop the theater, you're going to fill up your mop bucket here. And, you're going to take it up through this wheelchair ramp that goes all the way around. Uh, it may or may not be the longest wheelchair ramp in existence but it certainly goes all the way around the theater to the other side. So as I was saying, the, for this is the audience door. When the audience comes in, they come in from the mezzanine up, down this long path, through these doors, and they assemble here. Uh, and they will have a line to get tickets, and they will line up here to get in the door, and there'll be somebody to let them in there. Um, all of this will be four times, but. 
one of your shifts, one of the things you might have to do is set up a lobby. And if you do that, um, we have posters for each show that go up on this wall to show people what our season is going to be. And if there's, when we have a show going on, we'll generally have the actors' headshots set up on this wall too. So you can see who's playing each role. volunteer to help set that up. Uh, all of this will be explained in more detail by the agenda if you are on FOH crew, which you probably will be at some point this year. Uh, but just to know, this is the lobby, um, this is the box office, that's the water fountain, and this is where, this is where the magic happens.